Dear friends, today I am going to speak about a book. Its title is Rebels from the Mud Houses. The book is written by George Kunnath and it is published by Rockless. The book is forwarded by a well-known scholar, David Moss. As we all know, he did an extensive work on the caste system in India. As the title of this book suggests, this book is emphasizing on the armed struggle. The book is examining the Maoist struggle in Bihar. Under the rubric of Maoist struggle, the author is understanding the Dalit mobilization in Bihar. This book is based on field work in Dumri village in Jahanabad district. As we all know, central Bihar was under the grip of several caste struggles and a huge number of Dalit communities were killed in this region. After such killing, they responded and a huge number of people from the upper caste and upper OVCs were also killed in this struggle. This, this struggle grabbed the attention from various use. It attracted the attention of research scholars and they started working on this struggle. In this backdrop, this book is an important intervention to understand the social realities and the Dalit mobilization. With help from a case on Mushahar community, the book is articulating the plight of Dalit communities. As we all know, they are landless laborers in Bihar. And this book is very important to understand the, how social justice is working at the ground level. As we all know, the politicians from Bihar touted about social justice, but their version of social justice is not reaching to the common people to the Dalit communities, they are suffering from various kind of social exclusion and economic exclusion. This book is very important to understand how their agency is responding to such exclusions as we all know Bihar is very unequal society and this book is capturing the inequality in order to articulate the Dalit mobilization. Another thing is the ethnographic work. Many scholars and many researchers can get help from this book especially in the methodology because methodology of this book is very sound and it is based on a long ethnographic engagement in the rural Bihar as the author was also a development practitioner and he worked with several missionaries prior to completing the doctoral work. So methodology of this book is very strong and it is very important component of this book. Another thing is the identity of the Mushar community. If you will talk to people, especially common people in Bihar, they will 
they will associate the Mushahar community with Naxal and Maoist. This is a very dominant trend in Bihar. And this book is not resisting such kind of identities. Because Musahar community is residing everywhere in Bihar. They are in each district. But we considered them as a Maoist because they consider them as a monolith but they have a great diversity they are everywhere they are in North Bihar, South Bihar, Central Bihar and there is a great deal of diversity however this book is very important intervention to understand the social realities as this book is emphasizing on the early 80s to early 2000. These years are very important in the history of Bihar. Thank you so much.